days. Why have you not been picking up my call? I have been calling you all day and you refuse to pick my call. Mama, I was busy at work. Busy doing what? Just call her right now. Call her. Call who? Your sister. My only daughter called her. How would I call pressure? She's not in this house. Because of you, all your threats have been given to us. Precious, pick up all her things and left with a total stranger. Precious left? That is good news. Oh. We should be happy. You are a very wicked son. Hey, is that all you have to say? You don't even care about your sister's safety? Ah, Dave, you are, you are evil. Mama, that is all you are. Mama, please, I'm tired. I then want to call her right now or else. I will kill myself. I will kill my, uh, I will Mama, kill myself. Mama, I will 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 kill myself. Let me call pressure, Mama. Let me call her. Call her. Call her this. Call her. I will kill myself for you. Call her. <coughs> Mama, you're being too dramatic. Call her. I'm calling her now. Let's yes, call her. <coughs> Hello, Precious. Hello. Precious, my daughter. Uh, Precious, where are you? Pre Precious, it's me, your mother. I've gone, oh. Uh, I've gone. Considering everything that has been happening in this house and how badly and wicked you have been treating Mama and I since all this Cynthia thing happened. I mean, I've left you people, low. Oh. I've seen one very rich and handsome man in Ghana who has, you know, signified his interest in me. So now I'm living with him in Ghana before that notice. And, and, and guess what, Mama? Do you know that he is an orphan? <laughs> no father, no mother. Which means that my happiness is guaranteed. <laughs> Don't worry, Mama. Let me just settle down in his life. Once everything is permanent, I will invite you into the house so that you can take over. <laughs> okay, Mama. Bye. I will send you pictures from. <laughs> so, Mama, why, why are you now acting up? Your daughter says she has found another man to destroy. And very soon she'll come and take you to go and continue with what she's doing there. And you're crying. I don't understand you. You better pack your things. She'll come and. If you are wicked. You know what you have to say. You're not even worried about your sister's safety. With, with safety. Oh we should God. be worried about the innocent man's safety because that man's life is in danger. I mean, look at the kind of daughter you've raised. She's not even, the man has not even married her. She's thinking of taking over. Is this supposed to be your success story as a mother that you raised a demon who is out to destroy? Dave, it is you and that your Cynthia that are demonic that she has succeeded in tearing this family apart. Don't worry. I trust my daughter, a precious. She can never be intimidated. She will come back to us safe and sound. Mama, this thing you're saying is none of my business and I don't care. Hmm? Uh, do, do you know my happiness? My happiness is that one horned demon has just left my house and I can't wait for you to just join her so I can have peace in my house and bring my wife back. That is the only thing I, I worry about. Dave! Which wife? Claudia, what are you doing here? You this witch, what are you doing in my son's house? Oh, you and your daughter, you are nosing all around, hiding. Just to find the opportunity to come back to this house, it will not work. It can never work. Oh my goodness. Cynthia is not a dog to go back to her vomit. Cynthia now is upgrading her life. She doesn't have time for barking dogs like you. <laughs> you better mind the way you talk to me in my son's house. My son's house. My son's house. That is all you have in that little brain of yours. Don't you have anything else to say? All the time, my son's house, my son's house. Anyway, thank goodness Cynthia is now getting upgraded. Very soon, she won't need to have ever said, uh, my husband's house. She'll start to say, my house. <laughs> um, Mama, this one that you're here, I hope everything is okay. D did Shinta come with you? Sweetheart, that ship has sailed. <laughs> I'm not here for that. I'm here for um, Cynthia's documents. Her certificates, which you locked up in your vault. I'm here to pick them up. As you know, she's got a new job now. Mom, I've said this thing before. My wife will not work. Please do not make me remind you again. Cynthia is not property to be tossed to and fro. She's not your pet to be told what to do. She listened to you when she was your wife. Now she's with me. 
and I'm going to do everything to ensure she lives life on her terms. Don't test me, Dave. I will get those documents in peace or in war. <laughs> if you don't want to give up those documents, then I will ensure that security operatives are here. I will call the Inspector General of Police and this house will be too hot for you. Don't test me. You know that Claudia doesn't play. I speak it and I do it. When a child is not well trained, she will not listen to her husband, even if words of wisdom are coming out from him. Oh. <laughs> what exactly is your problem, darling? Is it amnesia or is it dementia? Because one minute you're insisting that my daughter will not be in my son's life. And the next minute you're referring to her as your son's wife. Pick a struggle. Or should we get you a psychiatrist? Claudia, do not insult me in my son's house. Anyway, I'm happy that now Cynthia is um, getting to be who she should be. Mama, don't forget that a man will always be a woman's crown. Always. Tell her, women like her are the reason why we have brutal homes everywhere. I will not even stop so low to gratify you with an answer because I can assure you your IQ is not high enough to understand what I'm about to say. It is better for a woman to be without a crown than to wear a crown of thorn. You all are here wasting my time. This isn't a talk show. I'm here for business. And if you won't give me the documents, I know how to get them myself. M mom, you're not going to my you're not going to my room. You're not going to my room. Mom, you're not going to you're not going to do this. You stop you. Stop harassing my son. Mom, I don't want to dis I don't want to disrespect you, but you, you don't have any right to enter my room. Disrespect me, then. Let's see how far you go. I will bring this building down if you. Mom, you don't have the right to enter my room. You need to do so. You need you don't do what is not right. Give me the documents. Give me the documents. Mom, I'm not giving you any document. My wife is not working. Hey! Yes! Hey, Maddie! Only God knows how many thieves have access to this. Mama, please. Mama, Mama, please, can you just help me and beg my wife? I want my wife back, please. I, I promise I will treat her right now. I promise. I did not come here for this kind of conversation. Cynthia gave you her conditions. Please don't pull me into it, okay? M Mama, but you, you, you can still help me and convince her. All right, see, Precious is no more here. And very soon my mother is leaving. So it will just be me and Cynthia in this house. Maybe. Leave it away. Dave, you don't know what you're saying in that your dirty mouth. I am not going anywhere. If you want me to leave, it, ready to kill me. Mama, please stay out of this. I've told you I'm bringing my wife back, and that is fine now. That's a lie. Claudia, what kind of a wicked witch are you? So you want to use your daughter to separate a mother and a son? <laughs> it will not work. My daughter and I are not as destructive as you. If anybody has caused a wedge between you and your son, it is you. What kind of a mother puts her greed and desires above the happiness of her son? Your son is gradually becoming a stranger. You are pulling out the beast in him, and one day that beast will come for you. You lie. Unlike you, I have raised my son in a better way. It can never be as useless. As your daughter. Well, for once, I actually agree with your mother. You are not a man. You never talk and follow it up with action. It's people like you that make women become slaves to their family or go mad trying to make their marriage work. Oh, do you expect him to dump his family because of Cynthia? <laughs> All this nonsense 
you are saying and you are doing is just initial drag -dra. Very soon, you and your daughter will come back on your knees, begging, let's bet, and it will not work for you. You must be delusional. If you think that the Cynthia that left this house is the same Cynthia that exists right now, people like you tend to forget that when you keep dishing out trouble to anyone, they develop thick skin. Thanks to you, my daughter is now a better version of herself and she's out of your son's league now. Claudia, let me tell you, no woman can ever be above the man, no matter what he achieves in life. It is said that there are cures for every disease, but unfortunately, there is no cure for acute stupidity, hatred and bitterness. You are the one who is bitter. Useless mother and useless daughter. Oh, you think you train your daughter right? Just wait. You know what those women do when they start working? Just when they are looking for promotion at their working place, they go out and sleep with their boss so that they will be able to achieve it. At the end of the day, they will lose the total respect they have as married women. Enough, mama. I mean, enough. I'm watching, I'm watching here, here. call my mother-in-law names. But if I must be honest with you, she's a better mother than you can ever be. Let's make no sense! Let's to his son! How dare you compare me with this useless woman? Mama, let me tell you something. Any woman can get pregnant and have a child. But not every woman can be a mother. And you're not, you're not a mother and you've never been a mother. Nah, see the reason why she started your other time. 